Frank Malloy, some of our Central Georgia pilots, air traffic controllers, and aviation mechanics come straight from Middle Georgia State University. Senator John Ossoff says he wants to give students more opportunities and has worked with the school to expand their resources. Jessica Chaw was on campus today. She joins us from the newsroom with more. Yes, that's right, Frank and Lori. Senator Ossoff took a ride in one of the university's helicopters just before the conference started, actually, so he's very on theme. He says that the school, he, he says that the school wants to, I'm so sorry, he says, um, and the school wants to make programs more accessible to students and to give Georgia's second largest industry a bright future. Aviation is essential to the state of Georgia. Senator John Ossoff says aviation is important for our economy and national security. He says its future is in the hands of students at Middle Georgia and wants to invest in them. Uh, I'm pleased to announce that with bipartisan support, uh, these resources, among other things, will go toward the acquisition of a cutting edge new simulator uh, to support flight training. It puts them a step ahead of their competition when they go to work for the airlines and when they hit those training classes. The aviation school's dean, Aiden Clark, says their current simulator is outdated and has been broken for a while. He says a lot of schools don't have this technology. It's first, it gives them an opportunity to see, uh, you know, larger aircraft cockpits. It's the type of simulator that 90% of our students are going to fly once they graduate. Patrick Johnny is a senior majoring in aviation management. He served in the military, so he's used to jumping out of planes and attack helicopters. He says this investment is recognition of their work. We work very hard every day, day in, day out. So to see us and recognize us and to invest in us, that, that's a, a overwhelming filming. Bennett Delaney is a flight science major. He says he dreams of becoming a Delta pilot. Kind of where my goals are now is just to give back kind of to the community that gave me so much. Delaney says he's glad that they're leaving something behind for future students to be the best prepared they can be and will help the industry in the present. Uh, aviation has been in the news a lot more recently because you've heard of the pilot shortages and maybe kind of the way we see us fixing that is through helping to build some of this infrastructure here. Ossoff has secured $2 million in funding for the school. In Macon, Jessica Chaw, 13 WMAZ News. Now, the Eastman campus will be getting the new simulator equipment, and they say they don't have it yet, but it'll be soon. Back to you guys. Thank you, Jessica. Mill Georgia State University says it's the only public four-year school in Georgia to offer an aviation program.